Hello, it's Ricardo, and welcome to Farming Simulator 2025. This is my first run through with this, and I have had to make a few adjustments to the system because even my system was running like a dog. I've got a 3080 Supreme, so that's a 10 gigabyte card, um, an i9. I've also got a kick ass SSD. And, you know, I was expecting slightly better performance. This is actually running in 1080p uh, and not 4K at the moment. And I have seen this and a lot of people I know, a lot of friends who have got the game have seen, you know, terrible performance. So I thought I'd have a quick look uh, as to what I was doing in regards to the settings here. So into options straight away and into the graphic settings as you can see I've got the hardware profile down to very high custom of course the thing is we all think our machines are really high because they were really high when they bought them or when we bought them and then you turn around and you realize hmm here's the thing that was three four years ago and you know technology moves on I've got the stream resolution set to um, 1920 by 1080 16 by 9 gonna play that in full screen mode all right, um, and you know, you, you could put it exclusive full screen and windowed, you know, we can play it in full screen mode, simple as that. Uh, all my scaling, I've upped the brightness a little bit. That's my own personal bit of accessibility that I need. Uh, away we go. So into advanced graphic settings. Now this is where it all clicks off. I've turned this down slightly, 220. I've turned it down from 160 to 155. Um, now 150. Everything else I've left the same. Space shading remains off. I have the option of screen space reflections to turn that off as well. But cloud shadows, I found that to be exceptionally GPU hungry, like shocking. And it was causing me a little bit of lag as well. So that's why I've kind of like changed. Like, and then also you have the options to volumetric fog and atmosphere quality as well if you wanted to turn that off but you want a good experience of the game so I'm very sort of slowly turning things off well by turning cloud shadows off and turning it down to um, 1080p that certainly has made a difference so we're going to apply all of those and then we're going to go back back to the main menu and then we're going to get onto the farm So here we are onto our farm in the tutorial in, like I say, 1080p. We got it on very high settings. We click through all the orientation on the interface. There you go. We can see now I can move it around. Very little lag, if any. You can see my stats at the top. The GPU isn't going particularly bandanas. You know, it's working okay. Performance before was terrible. And what we're going to do a little bit later in this video, we're going to ramp it back up to 4K and see how things go. But as you can see, I'm running. I've got very little, no screen tearing, very little lag or stuttering. I'm getting a solid 60 as what you'd expect for any game of this quality doing this at uh, 1080p. So if you are struggling, it's the cloud shadows I would look at sp specifically. So that's all great. Let's get out of here now and ramp that up to um, 4K. Okay, so any change is going to require a reboot So uh, to the resolution. So what we're going to do, we're going to leave it very high. Um, and then we're going to wrap that up to good old 3080 okay so now into display settings I'm going to ramp it up from 1080p to 2160 by 3840 I'm going to leave it at very high um, we'll leave VSync on okay I know that might not be applicable but we'll leave it on and we'll click apply and it's all going to reboot now when I said reboot obviously it means restart the machine uh, not restart the machine but restart 
the farming simulator 2025. So here we go. So I say I've got my my 4K up there. Uh, we're going to go back. We're going to go into Korea, the empty slot. We'll start continue. We'll wait for the game to ramp up. Right, okay, so straight off the bat, we've got our our lovely farmer in his attire, in his office, ready to go. Let's confirm that. And here we are, straight away, we can see GPU has jumped uh, to 79%, so that's probably an increase of about, I don't know, 30. Just click through all the messing about. They've got you to learn the interface. And that's not so bad. That's kind of like what I was expecting. 59, 60 frames per second. Very little lag. That is doable. And that was the change I did in regards to cloud shadows. So if you're having problems, I would start there. Ramp it down to 1080p. Do the changes I mentioned in the settings. If you, and then if you're happy with those changes at 1080p with your card, obviously with cloud settings, cloud shadows turned off, then back into farming simulator, ramp it up to your desired resolution. A little bit of a stutter there, I think. And um, see if you think it's playable. That's what I would do. Anyway, I've been Ricardo. Thanks very much for watching. Check back on the channel for more Farming Simulator 2025 videos. I intend to play the hell out of this. Who doesn't like a nice big tractor? Like and subscribe and I'll see you soon.